Welcome to VSS Monitoring's podcast series, the podcast series dedicated to helping you, the network professional, increase visibility to all of your users and lowering your costs while doing so. Hello and welcome to another episode of VSS Monitoring's monthly podcast. My name is Mark Lanucci, and I'm an account support engineer here with VSS. This month's topic, network security. We're going to be discussing how VSS Monitoring's distributed traffic capture systems can provide visibility and greater efficiency for security deployments in large-scale networks. VSS Monitoring is the world's leading innovator of distributed traffic capture systems and network taps. We provide you the visibility essential to leverage your existing investment in your monitoring tools and to take a proactive control of your network. The distributed traffic capture systems are the only access devices to combine selective aggregation, filtering, and load balancing with inline and span port capture. We offer a broad range of port densities, centralized management, and a graphical user interface for simple configuration. Today we'll be looking at a simple security deployment using these traffic capture tools to show you how they can provide passive network visibility, also act as a shield for monitoring tools, and enable hybrid deployments where the network and monitoring speeds don't match. This diagram depicts a typical network with a few workstation networks and a server farm. First, let's see what's going on in the edge of the network, which we'll call the WAN connection on the internet. We'll examine the monitoring of this network as it takes place near the firewall, on both the trusted and untrusted sides of the network. As we look at the network, we see that there are some inherent problems with visibility. One can simply monitor the trusted side of the firewall, but if the firewall causes problems, we can't necessarily troubleshoot or further understand the issue. Next, we can have to look at the possibility that an attack, if it passes through the firewall, is now directly causing problems on the trusted side of the switch causing any traffic from that switch to fail. So how can users determine quickly if there's a problem on the firewall? A distributed tap from VSS Monitoring can easily solve this problem. By creating a stealth inline layer in the network, network operators can quickly identify that there's a problem by using an intrusion detection system, an intrusion prevention system, or a unified threat management system in tandem with the configuration. There are other obvious advantages to this solution. First, we can see that the users may have many monitoring tool interfaces connected to distributed TAP, which allow for 10100, gigabit, and 10 gig speeds. Second, because the distributed TAP provides visibility to multiple networks, users can use a single 10 gig device to manage many 10100 and even gigabit networks. Or more commonly, you can use one gig analysis tools to monitor a single 10G network without any packet loss or compromise in monitoring performance. Now this is accomplished with a few features such as selective aggregation, filtering, and session-based load balancing. Third, as we likely have an additional monitoring interfaces available on even the lowest density distributed taps, we can have new monitoring devices capitalizing on the visibility provided by the device. Now let's look at some other scenarios, but add multiple DMZs, extranet, and B2B connections to help further determine the usefulness of the distributed traffic capture system. As you can see here, there are six capture points that would be extraordinarily useful to have visibility into. Let's examine these points. Here, the six aforementioned points of visibility can have added to the distribution tap with plenty of output ports left over for aggregation and distribution. Again, users may choose to have their outputs aggregated for single or multiple 10G links. They can even load balance them across multiple gig links. Load balancing operates independently of filtering and allows users to choose a method of traffic distribution to the monitoring tools. Now users, users can balance the traffic by a choice of MAC address, IP address, VLAN tag, TCP, UDP ports, or a combination of these. Also, importantly, the distributed tap provides a layer of stealth to all monitoring tools behind it. So to recap, VSS distributed traffic capture systems centralized monitoring for multiple sites within the network. They also overcome fundamental challenges like giving permanent visibility to performance analyzers, security, and forensics tools. 
They can mitigate attacks on monitoring tools by providing a layer of stealth. And lastly, distributed traffic capture systems can significantly decrease the amount of time taken to solve problems by giving visibility to potentially all networks in a single location. In closing, I want to thank you for listening. Feel free to go to our website, www.vssmonitoring.com, to find out more about our products or give us a call at plus one six five zero six nine seven eight seven seven zero to speak to one of our experienced support personnel who will be more than glad to assist you, like me. Once again, thank you for listening.